Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to the Save and Made Simple channel. My name is Bella and today we are back with a budget and stuff it for the money that I finally got from the township. Yay! Let's give them a round of applause for finally figuring it out. So today I have um, $245 in cash. I have broken down just a little bit without you guys. I'm sorry. I I was like, why am I? I, I haven't. Yeah. Anyway, so um, my check was for 380 and then my phone bill was 95 I was going to put off paying my phone bill until next pay, but um, unfortunately I get paid one day before it's due. So the phone bill is actually due on the 11th and I get paid on the 12th. So I'm going to have to pay the phone bill now, otherwise it's going to be late. So um, that money is going to have to go toward my phone bill, which is fine. So $95 went to my phone bill and then I'm going to send $40 to credit because I need to get some more stickers because I've made a couple new challenges for my Etsy store and I wanted to show you guys them, but um, they are made with the same sticker that I use for my loose change um, scratch and save. So these are my new Halloween ones. So this one here, it's got a $50 value and there's a price on every pumpkin. And then we've got this one here, which has a price or sorry, a value of 75. And this one here that has a value of 50. And what you're going to do is you're going to scratch each, st each sticker. And if you reveal a number, you're going to save the number. If you reveal a ghost, you're going to save 10. And that's the same for this one. Um, but of course the denominations are a little higher on this one. And then I also have this one here. So some of you guys are pretty big fans of um, the save the date challenge. So I made this one here. That's uh, it'll equal a little bit less because it's say uh, time is money. So um, you're going to write your time here. So you can do a certain time of day if you want to do like midnight. If you have a certain time you want to do, that's up to you. Um, but the reason why I wanted to do this one is because I noticed that the date is almost always like in the 20s. So um, I figure if I do the time, so even if it's 1230, that's one, two, three. So that's six right? Um, even if it's 9.55, that's 9.14.19. So like there's just less numbers to add together. So um, and there's also more spaces so you can do it for longer, which is another problem I'm having with save the date is that there's only 10 rows. So after 10, 10 times, I'm out of space and I have to start over. So time is money is now available on my Etsy store. And if you go over and check out my Etsy store, I have created bundles. So if you like mini challenges, there's a mini bundle. If you like um, games like this, um, there's a bundle for that. Or if you like scratch and saves, there's a bundle for that. But have no fear. If you are someone who likes all of it, there's a bundle for you too. It's an all-inclusive bundle. So that's all I'm going to say about that. Let's jump into this. So just I'll do a quick cash count. So we got 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, five two five ten fifteen twenty twenty five whoa hold on a second so i'm supposed to have 245 but i don't 20 40 60 80 1 20 40 50 60 70 80 90 5 2 5 10 15 20 25 i literally just counted this oh there's a 20 right there i thought i picked up all the money but i guess i didn't okay that will make more sense 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. There we go. Sorry, guys. I'm so excited to finally have this money that I just got really confused. So there is two bills. First, I'm going to go through my binders because there are two bills that if I can spare them, I would want to put them in my, um, my can. So... There was the 20, and that's probably why it was left out. I was trying to keep it aside. And there was a five, too. Was it that one? I don't really like it anymore. Definitely not. No, no, no. That's okay. I think it's just going to be a 20 then. I would, if I can. I'm going to have to wait until I'm done budgeting to see if I can save that or not. All right, so let's go through my binders and see what I need to do with money because I haven't actually budgeted anything yet. Um, I, this is all live. I haven't thought about it really. Um, 
yeah. So, um, let's see. I'm going to go through this. So, groceries, I'm out of money. I spent the whole 30 I had. I'm going to have to get gas. Um, okay, so I'm going to put uh, gas or groceries. I think I'm just going to do like... 40 because we've got lots of juice boxes we've got lots of the expensive stuff um gas i'm gonna do ba, 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 ba. i can probably get away with doing 30 so that's 70 dining out um I'll just do 20. Pets are fine. Kiddo is fine. That's all good. Okay, so we're not going to do any more in that one. Let's go to this one. So, 4. So, right now we are at 4, 7, 9, 10. So, we're at 1, 4, 7, 8, 9. Yeah, four. we're at 90 right now. So we've got one fifty-five to go. Um, so one fifty-five. I would like to do some savings challenges on both sides. So if I do ninety, one hundred ten times one thirty. Okay, so I'm gonna do forty dollars towards sinking funds. All right, so that's 80, 130. Um, so that gives us, we all know I shouldn't be doing math without a calculator. That gives us 115. I'm just gonna do some math and make sure I'm right because I don't wanna make a fool of myself again. So we got 40, 30, 20, 40. Oh, sorry minus 245 okay i'm right Whew. just making sure because last time i was not and i had to refilm the entire video okay so now we're gonna do that um and then the rest i'm gonna put towards savings challenges so if we do 45 let me see 115 minus 50 we can do 50 and 65 so we'll do mini, 50, large, 65. And so I'll do the, um, the large savings challenges in this video. And then I will do the minis for a video for next Monday. How does that sound to everybody? First, we got to start by stuffing these. So I said for groceries, I was going to do 40. First, I should put these... Oh no, I didn't factor in that 20. So if I take $10 out of both minis and larges, that'll be 40 and 55. But I wanna do at least 45. I don't know, we'll figure it out, okay. Um, I'm just not gonna put the 20. It's, it's a nice 20, but it does have a big crease right down the middle, so I'd rather put it in my savings challenges. At that point, it's going into savings anyway. So, um, that's gotta go somewhere else, it's bothering me already. And then we got my fives. Okay. So groceries, we're gonna do $40. And that'll get me anything I need to top up for next week. Gas, I said 30, so we'll do a 20 and a 10. So with that in there. And then dining out, I said 20, so we'll do a 20 in there, didn't I? Yeah, okay, good. So that's that. And then for my sinking funds, I said I was going to do 40, so I'm gonna do $10 in each. So what I'm gonna do, take that out, put this in. And then gifts, 
going to do the same, take that out and put this in. Vacay, I think I'm probably gonna do the same thing. Take that out and put this in. And car, I just wanna put 10 in. And you know what, I'm actually, um, I'm going to be honest. I did take, I told my, I said I wanted to take my son to the movies or to go bowling or something. And um, unfortunately we couldn't go bowling because I didn't have my money, I couldn't afford to, but I did take him to the arcade and I put $20 into the machine and that was out of my dine out money. So I'm actually going to take that $20 back anyway, because that was money for my dine out fund. And I want to put that back into my wallet. Just because that's what's fair. It was my money. And I did spend it on him with the... And you know what? Since it's personal money, I'm going to put it back in here anyway. I'm just going to play with it. Because I've got my dine out. You know what? I'm going to take $10 of it. I'll take 10 and put it in my wallet for dining out. Because I will be getting more money from the government. Um, not from the government, from the insurance, uh, should be getting it on Friday. I would knock on wood, but the dog would go crazy. Um, so yeah. Okay, so this is what we're going to play with. We're going to be playing with 20, 40, 50, 60, 5, 75, 85, 95, 1, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So... Ew. Ew. That's a really ugly 20. Um, let me see if I have any change to throw in here, just in case we need it. Let's see, we've got, got lots of little change. There's a toonie. There's a loony. A loony. I think that's all I've got. All right, so I'm going to be splitting up the money that I need for the large challenges. So we need 65, so we got 20, 40, 50, 65. And then this money, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. I'm just gonna do that. There we go, now they're like almost split in half. So this will be for minis next Monday. So let's grab, I'm gonna put all of these away. I do have my thing here, I was gonna put, I was gonna put a $5 bill in it. Where'd that $5 bill go? Oh, I decided not to, didn't I? Okay, I need to keep notes of the things I changed my mind on. Okay, put that there, there, and there. We're gonna play some games. I'm just gonna get them all set up and I'll be right back. All right, so let's play some games. Grab a dice. All right, so the way that I do this is I do have these here games. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to roll two dice and whatever I roll is the challenge I'm going to go to. I'm going to play one round of every game that I roll. If I play a game three times, I will cut myself off and not play it a fourth. So let's go. We got a four, which is dots and boxes. All right, so the way I'm playing this right now is um, I'm gonna roll a dice. Whatever the dice comes up with is how many lines I'm going to draw. And whatever, um, if I say I roll a three, then I can go one, two, three, and every box that I fill, I fill will have a three in it to mark that's how much I am spending. So I'm gonna roll a five. And the cool thing about this game is that I can take control and decide how much I want to save each day. So I'm gonna draw, so five lines. So I'm gonna do one, two, three, four, five. So I'm only saving 15, which isn't an only, but you know what I mean. So dots and boxes is gonna get 15 today. I need my binder. The cool thing about this is if you're planning on like a really small budget, then you'll still be able to play a little bit. Um, 
like because you can like I said decide how many boxes at least until you get all of them filled in like this so that you can't really do anything so so far in dots and boxes we have 20 35 45 and five loonies I'm gonna pull those out and put a five dollar bill in there or better yet I'll put a ten dollar bill in there there we go I could put that 20 in. I still might. We'll have to just wait and see what I do. All right. Sorry, my kid has headphones in and he's decided he wants to sing today. So, all right. So let's move that. I need, where'd that other dice go? Did I put it away? Or did I lose it? All right. Let's go again. There's eight. All right. So we are going to be playing uh, Plinko. Which, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my red die as the plying piece. And every time I roll, I'm going to move my dice down the ladder until I get to a number that says I owe. So, this is the one we decide. And it's a three, three dollars. Good thing I pulled all of these um, loonies out. Three dollars goes to Plinko. Dun, dun, dun. And I haven't, oh, right. Um, so Planko is available on Etsy under Fairy Rose Cottage. You know, let's just go through this really quick because I just realized I didn't uh, do this last video either. Okay, so this is something I made. It's not available anywhere. Bucks and Rolls is not available on my shop. It's only available if you order um, one of the games packs. Uh, yeah, um, this one here is, again available only by me and it is not available on my channel either or on my store either it is uh only available if you order a gamers pack it's basically just a pack of games <laughs> so dots and boxes this one is available on my uh etsy store um but it's a, it is also available as a gamers pack this one here is also available on my store or any gamers pack this one my store yep this one, again, my store. This one, again, my store. There is some from other people. This one here is by Fairy Rose Cottage. It's available on Etsy under Fairy Rose Cottage. This one here is by Little Birdie Canada and it is available on Etsy. All of the links will be in the description below. This one here is by Fairy Rose Cottage as well. It's Shut the Box. And then Never Have I Ever is by Lunova B. And then uh, when I'm done with the um, Never Have I Ever, I will be playing this one here, which is my Loose Change. Uh, it's available on my store um, by itself in, a, in packs of four or in a scratch and save bundle. And then this one here is my new game. So when um, the save the date is full, I'm going to replace it with this until I get that one all organized. So this one here is currently uh, brand new and available on my store as well. Okay, now we can roll. Let's do this. So we've got 11... You don't get to play 11 very often. Shut the box. Okay, so the way they shut the box works, I'm going to roll two dice. And I am going to find, in this line, I'm going to find two numbers that equal the sum of the dice, one or two numbers. So if I roll a nine, I can do the nine or I can do the eight and the one. And I'm gonna keep going until I no longer have any boxes that I can color. So we've got a five. Let's just go for the five. I like to do the smallest numbers as late as I possibly can, but you know, man almighty three. I want some big numbers gone. That's a five. Oh no. Am I out already? There's no way. Okay. I'm out already. I don't even know if I have enough money to play. Okay. I do. So we got nine, 17, wait, nine, 17. <laughs> Sorry, I tried. 9 plus 8 plus 7 plus 6. 2 plus 1. That's $33. Save the date. What are you doing to me? Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I swear my kid's not like a bad singer. It's just because he's got headphones in and he can't hear himself. <laughs> That's what I always tell him. You, when you're when you got your headphones on, you're kind of pitch deaf and it's very loud. But you know, he's only nine. <laughs> Shut the box is getting thirty three dollars today. 
So there's, I'll take that out. So then there's 40. And then if I take this two out, then there's 45. There we go. So now we are at $50 in here. I am going to go and give my kid the universal hush sign. I'll be right back. We'll see if that worked. He did, he did, uh, I frightened him. I didn't mean to. Um, okay. So let's roll again. So we got number seven, which is bingo. Okay. So what I've been doing with bingo is I've been just rolling the dice and picking however many numbers pop up on the dice. I'm not going to say I'm not going to do that, but I was thinking one. Ooh. Yeah. So the new, um, new coins. So this one here is from 2023 and they've all got men on them now. So I'm assuming that's, yeah, that's Charles, which is weird. I've, I've only ever seen them with Queen Elizabeth on them, but of course Queen Elizabeth is no more. Anyway. Okay. So I'm just going to roll and figure it out. Two numbers. I can handle that. Okay. So if we do two, three, four, five, ten. Let's do 10. Oh, okay. Why well, even bother doing all those? We'll do the 10 and I'm going to do six and four. There we go. Just because why not? Oh, I need to mark off that free space too. There we go. So bingo. There we go. So Bingo currently has, whoops, whoops, there we go. Bingo currently has 20, 30, 5, 40, and 5 in it. And when it's done, I will have, oh, 46, sorry. And when it's done, I will have 100. There we go. All right, so we have 5, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 to go. What games can I play with 13? Let's just, we'll just have to see what we roll in six. With 13, I can play positive savings. Rebel, quit that. Okay, so I'm going to do a five. So we'll do this one trying to keep them spread out a little bit because I don't want them to all be the same colors. There we go. So that's positive savings. There it is. And this one's been doing really great. I do believe when it's full, it'll be at 130. So we got 55. So we got $60 in here now, which is pretty good. All right. All right, I'm down to eight bucks. Let's see what I can play with eight bucks. I know I can play, da, da, da. I can probably play Wizard of Oz, Planko. Ooh, no, probably can't. I might be, mm. okay, let's do, I can, mm, I was gonna say never have I ever, but if I'm, if I've done it, I save 10 bucks, so. I don't have 10 bucks. Bucks and rolls. I could go grab another toonie. Bucks and rolls, probably not. Journey of Gratitude, maybe. I could maybe do Journey of Gratitude. So I'm here. So if I rolled a one, that's six. Two would just be two. Three, four, five would be 10. So one, two, three, four. If I can get a one to, a one to four, I can handle it. If I get bigger than a one or four, if I get bigger than a four, I think I'm kind of screwed. Okay, I can handle that. All right, so one, two. All right, I will put $2 into Journey of Gratitude. All right, I have $6 left. Should we just go to Plinko and get it over with? Number nine. So as long as I get, as long as I don't get a two, I'm happy. So we're going to use this one as the play piece. So I don't need, I don't want a two at the end of the game. <laughs> okay. Get a two, a five, a one, a one, no two, no two. There we go. Four. 
Nobody saw that. That's perfect. Six. That's exactly what I have. Okay. So the one thing I don't like about Plinko is it doesn't have like a tracker of any sort. I'm sure I could just keep track on the back or even in like the side, but yeah, I don't know. It just, it, I, it feels like I could cheat whenever I want with this one and no one would even know. All right. So in here we got 25, 35, 40, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7. We got 47 in Plinko. And that wraps up the large savings and the that will be the end of the budget and stuff it as well um so thank you guys so so much for watching please join back on monday um i might be adding money to the mini nope i won't be i was just gonna say because i i'm expecting to get a check from the insurance on like friday um but if I do, then I'll just do a budget and stuff it and we'll go from there. Um, so I will see you guys on Monday with my minis. And thank you guys so, so much for the support. I will see you guys then. Take care. Bye.